LibreOffice 6.0 is a major step forward for productivity software. An EPUB export filter has been added to save documents as ebooks. It's now possible to import Quark Express version 3 and 4 files, while support for OOXML has been improved as well. The user interface customization dialog has been redesigned to be more intuitive and user friendly. The special characters dialog has been improved with a new search facility along with recent and favorite characters. Also, a new drop down icon in the toolbar lets you quickly add special characters. A new icon set for the toolbars, called Elementary, has been added. If you want to save an image that's embedded into a document and the image has been modified, you can now either save the original version or the modified version. On all desktop platforms, you can now use OpenPGP keys to sign and encrypt ODF documents. TSCP-based classification now allows multiple policies and in Writer you can mark and sign individual paragraphs. A selection from the popular open source Noto font family is now included by default due to its large Unicode coverage, while fonts for Hebrew and Arabic have been added as well. Finally, the help system has been improved to be more user-friendly and work better with mobile devices. New table styles have been added to the word processor to make your documents and data look even better. A drop-down list has been added to the Find toolbar, which helps to make navigation simpler. When you're performing a mail merge, it's now possible to use data from tables inside Writer itself. A new Form menu has been added, making it easier to add interactive forms to your documents. When you've inserted an image into a document, you can now rotate it to any angle rather than in steps of just 90 degrees. It's now possible to have split sections inside tables. Custom dictionaries are more flexible using innovative human language technology, helping professional journalists, editors and writers. In the spreadsheet, new commands have been added to select unprotected cells on protected or unprotected sheets. If a sheet is protected, a lock symbol appears at the beginning of the sheets tab. Using the file export dialog, you can now export a cell range selection or a selected group of shapes in PNG or JPG format. The links dialog has been simplified, while three new ODF 1.2 compliant spreadsheet functions have been implemented for finding and replacing text using byte positions. Ten great new templates have been added for home and business use to make your presentations really stand out. In addition, the default aspect ratio is now 16 to 9, so your new presentations work with widescreen displays straight away. In LibreOffice Online, the cloud-based version of the suite, many improvements have been made to the interface. User avatars are now supported, which are displayed in comments. In addition, links in comments are now detected automatically. Dialogues have been added and updated, such as insert special characters and find and replace. Spell checking is now available across Writer, Calc and Impress, while the status bar now shows the current language of text being edited. Writer now has an interactive horizontal ruler, like in the desktop version of the suite. In Calc, an active cell reference box has been added, and basic editing of charts has been implemented.